Hi, this is Alex from Tired Education and this is a very quick video on the tab to transient function in Pro Tools. I'm just going to take you into this session now. Only a couple of tracks, just a live session, a couple of mics on the drums, bass and keys, uh, which are both DI'd. Um, what I'm going to very quickly show you what the tab to transient function does. It's activated up here. You can turn it off just by clicking it. And what that does is when you hit the tab key on your keyboard, it will take you to the next detectable transient in your track essentially. So say if I wanted to just make some very quick edits, I can literally just hit tab, hit tab, keep on hitting it. Okay, I want to split it there and then I'll split it. If I go back there and then I'll go here. It's a very, very quick and useful tool. It's a small feature, but it's one that's really going to speed up your workflow not only with single tracks, but also with groups as well. I'll demonstrate it. So if I have just these four drum drum tracks here, I've just got a kick, snare, and two overheads. Hit Command G, call it drums two, because I've already got a drums one. And um, now I can do exactly the same on drums. So all of the tracks are gonna split, all of them are gonna go to the next transient every time I press tab. I can then make very small edits or I can do whatever I want with the audio. So with groups is very useful, with single tracks is obviously very useful. And um, yeah, very quick video, very useful feature in Pro Tools. It's going to massively speed up your workflow with editing and with any other audio tasks that you may want to perform. And um, yeah, that was it. Hope you, hope you enjoyed it and please subscribe to the Tired Education YouTube channel for any future videos that we put out and hit the bell button when you want to be notified. Thanks again and I'll see you on the next one.